Joining me right now are Annie and John McMahon. And Annie, I'd like to speak with you first. Tell everybody how old you are and tell them just what, how well you're doing now after a double lung transplant just seven months ago? Seven months ago. I'm 20 years old and on October 23rd, I received a double lung transplant. And now I just feel so great. It's amazing. Last year, I spent only 48 days out of the hospital. So to be back with my family and friends and just being able to do so much more, it's so amazing. It's amazing. And you said that this is something now you go to schools, you speak about the importance of organ donation. I normally go to high schools because the age now is 16 to sign up to become an organ donor. And I think it's really important for that just because New York is number 50 out of 50 um, on the organ donation list. Wow. Yes. It is really important. People need to step up to help people like yeah. yourself. A double lung transplant is amazing. You're doing so well. We're so and happy. Especially they're all like around my age so they could relate with me more. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the kids said that they were, they always thought it was for someone older to get a transplant, but then they see someone like me. And there are people younger than me, so it's good to know. You it know? is really good to know. And Dad, your beautiful daughter is standing next to you here today. How proud of you, of her, are you? She's amazing. She, you know, last year was a tough year for us, and uh, she fought through it, and uh, she's in a much better place now, so it's great. And you guys come out and show your support for the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. What have they done for your family? Uh, I, I can't even, words can't describe what they've done. You know, when Annie was born, the life expectancy for uh, kids with CF was only 18. And now, 20 years later, it's in the mid 30s. So the money that we raise here today goes to find a cure uh, and fund science. So hopefully, people don't have to go through a lung transplant. But amazing that she's done it and she's doing so well. So we're so grateful for that. And thank you both this morning. Have a beautiful day. Thank you, thank you, you too. All right, Andrea, back to you.